With its intricate web of cables and pipes, this is an artificial sun. And in China, it is the future of clean energy technology. It's a reactor in eastern Anhui province that utilizes nuclear fusion, a process that naturally occurs in the sun. Atoms of hydrogen fusing together to create helium, which results in huge amounts of energy. China had a relatively late start in nuclear fusion development, but given our local government and central government's high level of attention in innovation, especially as our domestic processing and manufacturing sectors developed, it accelerated some of our processes. Nuclear fusion has become attractive because it holds the promise of limitless amounts of energy without the harmful greenhouse gases that cause global warming. But the process is difficult and expensive. That's in part why China has partnered with several countries on the project, including the European Union, India, Japan, Russia, the Republic of Korea, and the United States. Fusion is not something that can be accomplished by one country. The nuclear reactor has already achieved several firsts. In 2017, it became the world's first facility to maintain proper conditions for nuclear fusion for longer than 100 seconds. Last November, the reactor achieved a temperature of 100 million degrees Celsius. That's six times hotter than the sun's core. The hope is to have a fully functioning plant by 2050 and build a separate reactor that could produce fusion power for commercial use. A man-made model of the sun to help support life here on Earth. Francis Coe, CGTN.